Yo, yo, yo. It's Fran coming to you again. Today in this video, we're gonna change the fuel pump on the Infiniti G35X. It's having some issues starting up. Um, I hit the key and it just takes a while to start. I think it's low fuel pressure. I know it hasn't been done yet. Uh, here is fuel pump Hitachi. That's what comes in there. I gotta replace the whole, uh, I gotta basically take this out of the entire plastic container type thing. That's gonna be fun, but yeah, looks good. There goes the T35, let's uh, take that seat off so I can show you guys where it's at. All right guys, so to take this pump out, you're gonna go in the back seat and then there's like this little black tab, you see it? Either you pull this and then it just comes right out. It's all that, just pull it. Same thing on the other side. Pull that tab, black tab, and then just see, just comes right out. All right, get your seat belts out of there. Take this seat out. So you got the seat off, okay? What you gonna do, get one of these, turn it to the right. Turn these to the right. All of them go to the right, and then this whole thing will pop up. And then we're gonna have some bolts to take off. Doing this with one hand, so bear with me. Let's just pop that connector off right now. Push in. Pull it. There we go. And then you also have this one here. This one is, I think you gotta I'm gonna get a, a rag and some paper towels because I know it's gonna leak. Uh, push this in and then it'll come out. And then I think we have some eight millimeter bolts. I'll double check. Uh, let's see. Eight millimeter. Yeah, it's definitely an eight millimeter, all right? I'm using this ridiculous extension for no reason because I couldn't find a shorter one. Loosen these up. Take all these out, and then we'll take out this connection here. Now we're gonna take this out, show you guys. Get some paper towels though. Paper towels. You don't want this gas to go all over the place. Hope you guys can see this. Paper towels, just put it in this area. Now you're gonna squeeze here, squeeze and then pull. Ah, there you go, see, that comes out. So all you're doing is you're squeezing here, squeeze this tab and then squeeze it and just pull this out. Be careful with this little lever, this little thing right here. Um, there's also this other connection here. All right, so I got this thing out. It took me a little bit of time to figure it out. This here is gonna have like a hose connected to it right here there's like little tabs that you pull out and then it just pops it down. I'll show you those tabs. Here are all those little tabs here. Okay, so you just spread those out, spread them out and then it just pops down, okay? And watch for this little clip here, but it just popped out for me. But take a look at this clip if it gets stuck, all right? That's how you get that, this hose off. Now to get in there, right? You gotta pull these clips out. One here, one here, one on the other side, one there. And then this whole top part would just pull off. Okay, those little clips come off, pull this up. This piece will get off of here. And guys, please be careful with this, it's plastic. Don't overdo it and be aggressive, it will break. You will break it. So pull this connection off.
pull this connection off, okay? And then you're gonna take these clips off the bottom and then we'll get to the pump in there. This is what it looks like, all taken apart. Okay, that comes off of there. And just watch the orientation as this comes out, okay? Make sure you put it back the same exact way. Um, it only goes in, you see how this opening is here? So this connector would be in that direction, if that makes sense. Uh, and then you just get your new one, slide it in there, and then just try to do this all in reverse order, man. So this is how you would remove the fuel pump on a G35X 2004. All right, I hope this video helps. Uh, let me know in the comments if I should have done something else or you guys wanted to see something else. Uh, man, I appreciate you guys for watching. Later.